And we're back. In the museum. I love this game. <laughs> it's getting good. It's it's really, really picked up from where it started. I watched the intro cutscene again recently, and as hilarious as it is, it kind of doesn't do the game justice. No, it doesn't. <laughs> but it's quite fun. Gets your attention, I'll give it that. Yeah. Anyway, we were uh, dealing with ghost girls in the elevator. Yeah, they don't want us to leave. I don't know if they're malevolent or just cheeky. Something I've been wondering is whether she does it every single time. There's a thought. <laughs> She's not very persistent. She just does it the once. She did it, yeah. Well, I'm not sure what we do otherwise. you got to press 2. Maybe if this, if you, Can we go to 1, maybe? Let's give it a shot. Oh, I think we can. Ah, so it's only when we try and go to 2. Maybe it was only just the once, though, like, my guess. I think further up there's a broken elevator, a broken ladder, and a frayed line or something. I don't know. There but was nothing on this floor, really, though, that we needed. Uh, well, there's a secret room we need to find our way into. Ah, that's a good point. So, I think it's this way. Is this unlocked? Maybe. Don't you knock. Oh, you... Wow. Oh! There's banging going on in there. Okay. It's to so... the oven. Well, at least they left the power on on this, right? <laughs> uh, pretty sure that's just... Uh, the wind. Face jumps up. Oogly boogly boogly. Maybe. Hello? <gasps> Is someone there? Nigel! Lucy! <laughs> Why? I have my reasons. Call oh it. my god, that is not a human face. Called it, called it, called yes, it. Yes, you did, that is terrifying. She did not rise, she appeared. Anyway, um, Could you back away from the fan just a little bit, Lucy? We probably shouldn't question about breaking in, considering our own tendencies. What reasons? Oh, never mind that. I'm looking for a Pacentus catus. Come again? Cats, Nigel. Cats. Oh, I see. And you think they're here? Perhaps. I know this place is hiding something. Hang on. I'll meet you next door. Hmm. Okay, well, she's doing something useful. God, she's quick. <laughs> Didn't you see her go across the fence? Huh? <laughs> oh, yeah. This is unexpected. I know. I don't know whether to be impressed by your chivalry or worried about a potential stalker. You've lost me. Hmm. You did follow me in here, didn't you? No. My own business brought me here. Your own business? And what would that be? A ghost hunting and the art of Nicholas Gurney. What? <laughs> I'm a treasure hunter. <laughs> I was about to say that. <laughs> <laughs> Why is she looking for cats in a butterfly thing? Well, we heard cats earlier, I don't know. I guess she's just leaning on it now. That's a weird way of doing things. Oh, well. So, any leads on the missing cats? Nothing. Nothing at all. Why do you think they were here? A hunch. This old place used to be the town hall. So? It's riddled with old service passages and underground rooms. I know. I've only just escaped the basement. Any cats? No, but... Uh... There is something down there. Hmm. Have you seen anything strange? What? You mean stranger than us two breaking into the museum? Y yes. <sighs> Fancy joining me on a vigil? A what? A ghost hunt, Lucy, with technology. <laughs> You're serious? <laughs> you really believe in ghosts? Wow, she is out of the loop. What was in that package? This morning. Oh, this morning seems so long ago. Ghost hunting gadgets. Okay, okay so we, we can go for posh. Like, really posh. Or really childish. <laughs> Let's go childish. It's so diverse. <laughs> Ghost hunting gadgets. And you trust them? I don't need to trust them. I know it works. Who sent them? 
A friend. A fellow enthusiast, if you like. Yes, but who makes them? Oh, no one. I, I can't talk about it. Can't or won't? So, you believe in an afterlife, then? Uh, um, <laughs> oh, don't ask such a serious question out of the blue, Lucy. Let's just talk about why you're broken into the museum. Oh dear. <laughs> Maybe she's trying to distract us from that by yeah. starting a theological discussion. Ugh, of all the places. <laughs> a oh. debate in the butterfly room, yes. I think I'll go with this one because we've seen a bunch of spirits. Yeah. And it's actually an answer to the question unlike this one. Yeah. I like to think that the, the spirit lives on. Belief in the paranormal is not logical. It exposes fears and doubts in the individual. I know what I'm doing. No, you don't. You're surrounding yourself with false hope. No, the ghosts of this town will lead me to that treasure. Is that what this is about? That damn treasure? Wow. Show her the photographs. You do anything. It's like you have so much evidence in your back pocket. In fact, go to your inventory and see if you can push something on it. I can't at the uh, moment. Hmm. This town's kept its secrets for too long from me, Danvers. But something which is lost is not meant to be found, though. Ah, uh, any three will do. I think it's just the same combo anyway. I'm gonna go with three, try and rope her into this. Go for it. Have you never wondered where it is? If it exists? It's a myth. Yes, I've wondered about it as a child. But you grow up, you move on, you get a job, a life, a purpose. Well, I haven't got a job. Or a purpose. <laughs> if that seems stupid to... I didn't say it was stupid. I just don't understand. Maybe I'm boring, too sensible, too logical. If this is your thing, then that's fine by me. Well, my thing may find us that damn treasure. Okay, I give in. How, Nigel? How will it help us? These exhibits, right here. They look harmless. They're haunted? Perhaps. Here, take this. It's dangerous what to go alone. It? it looks like a tool. It's an EMF meter. It tracks electromagnetic phenomena. Oh, like energy waves. Exactly. It'll crackle if the readings become significant. Significant? What? You mean a ghost? Not necessarily. Changes in the magnetic energy could indicate that uh, something, a force, is drawing energy to manifest itself. That's creepy, Nigel. Try to stay calm. Some say fear itself can encourage bad spirits to appear. Look, let's just get on with it, shall we? Before I change my mind. Where is Danvers getting all this information? It's just got weird. I'm looking in this room yeah, while we yeah, can. Yeah, definitely. He knocks on the door anyway. <laughs> oh, it's surprisingly dull. Oh, a plan of the vault. The boat store, a net hut. Oh. Plans by Frederick Ager. That name again. What would Lucy Rubens want with this? And what was she really doing in this room? It's a trap, Nigel. It's yeah. a good thing we didn't give her the taser, otherwise we'd be knocked out already. Wait, do we have to go through this again? Oh. The boats. Anyway. <laughs> plans by Frederick A. I was wondering if I could photograph it. Ah, right. What would Lucy Rubens want with this? I think we just have what to know it exists. What was she really doing in this room? That's not right. Okay. No. All right. Go back. <laughs> Booze. What? That's not very well disguised. That's a terribly passage. disguised passageway. You use a taller bookcase, guys. Check the rest of the room while we're here. Where's the advent? Yeah. And Drawers. Draw. Huh. There's literally nothing there. Oh no, let's move a little slower. That's kind of bizarre, but okay. I think it's just so you can see where the vent was. Fair enough. There's that, but we can't interact with it. 
Yep. Okay, let's uh, go. Let's just leave her. <laughs> Left or right? Ooh. Check the floor first. There's nothing. Alright. Let's go right. You chose wrong. Look at all the spy holes. What? They must lead somewhere. Different passageways? Hold on, what are we seeing? He's looking up into the pipes. Oh, the pipes. I think. Not the spy holes. Okay. But otherwise, uh, I don't think there's much here. Well, what about those two next to each other? That's got to be something. Ah. So you can walk along this and spy on the museum. That's pretty cool. Okay. <laughs> this is, like, evil. Can we spy on Lucy? What's with the music as well? Oh, don't make that noise. Squidgy maps. It's a policeman. Okay. Oh. Verity Church. 6th of November, 1952. Local policeman Stephen Harris is heading the sh uh, search. Okay. Oh, which will take place in the Erie Saxton Caverns. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Ah! We found her! <laughs> she's right here. Bit ephemeral and malevolent, but you know. She's here. <laughs> um. Glasses. Um. Uh, oh, that, that spy hole. Yeah, I think we've been to this one. Oh, yeah, you're right. It's, it's just a spy hole, anyway. Can we leave now? I'm scared. Can we go right and then right again? What I was thinking. No, my bad. Okay, let's go fight Lucy. You know. Hey, know Lucy, you... did you see that? Oh. What is that? An alarm? A phone? Green sleeves. That's the um. It's that, that guy, was... the reporter. It's... No, it's got to be the other one. They must lead somewhere. Hello? <gasps> no, I'm in the museum. No, he's here. Why? He didn't say anything about ghosts. No, it's too much. I'll never do that. How can you say that? I've always been supportive. As soon as possible, I hope. This place is creepy. Okay. I'll meet you by the Martello Tower at usual time. Okay, love you too. <gasps> Scandal! <gasps> She's been leading us on this whole time! <laughs> <laughs> okay. This is creepy. I'm probably talking to... Uh, what was it? What's his face? The reporter, um... Rick? We've got his card. Give us a sec here. It's... Press uh, uh, on the right. Yeah. Alex Spitmore. Ah, she's been against us the whole time, see? Hmm. Who are you talking are you okay? to? Glad for the company, in all honesty. I like your Gryffindor scarf. Any paranormal activity? Well, there have been some reactions, but whether it's paranormal... Still sceptical, huh? Always, uh. Nigel. Always. Well, look at these photographs. <laughs> oh, you can Photoshop, I see. What? I it's the 50s! <laughs> or, or, or some era. We, we have not. smartphones and stuff. I'm not sure. <laughs> I hope they explain this sometime. Yeah. Did I hear a phone? Phone? No. Not that I know of. <gasps> it's just mobile phones <clears throat> are the prime cause of false EMF readings. Well, I haven't got one, so I think we're fine. Okay, no worries. I'ma just search your pockets. <laughs> Lies, Lucy! There's an active entity here in the museum. Really? You mean a ghost? Entity, manifestation, spectre, phantom. Call it what you will. Where is it? 
I haven't seen or heard anything. It tried to pit my pocket. She's playing with the elevator and the power. She? How can you sex it? <laughs> I've seen <laughs> it. Oh dear. Oh Lucy, Lucy, Lucy. It tended to be, I don't know, the wives of Henry VIII or grey ladies. Not this one. She's unique, playful, and strange. Huh. And back to the cats. Yes, the ever important quest to find out what happened to the cats. Probably is, I just don't care. <laughs> the cats know where the crowd is. And they're being killed <laughs> off one by one to keep the secret safe. <laughs> Any sign of the missing cats? No, nothing. Poor wretched creatures. Nanny Noah said that. Back in bit. <laughs> sure, why not? Back in a bit. Okay, but be careful. Mm. Wellity, wellity, wellity. Lucy is lying to us. Shall we attempt the elevator again? <laughs> ah, quick look around, see if Danvers notices anything. But yes, we should try the elevator again. If we're expected to, like, use the equipment again on, like, the stuff in the museum, I'll be very disappointed. Does this activate even at night? <laughs> you just see all the ghosts we've seen so far sitting in the chairs. Hey, Danvers. We're trying to watch the movie. Ah. Hey, hey, Ruben's just turned a little to the right. Up. Oh, I think she saw it. Nope, wait for it. That EMF meeting. <laughs> Ugh. You sure you don't have a mobile phone? Lucy. Are you okay? Glad for the company, in all honesty. Okay. She saw nothing. Back in a bit. Okay, but be careful. Absolutely useless. 